हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू एसएसटी क्लास टेक आउट चैप्टर नंबर सिक्सटीन मीन्स ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट सो येस्टरडे वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट रोडवेज इट्स टाइप्स इट्स क्लासिफिकेशन इंपॉर्टेंट रूट्स लाइक जीटी रोड गोल्डन क्वारिलेटरल सो टुडे वी विल डू मैप वर्क इट विल मेक यू मोर क्लियर अबाउट द अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ इम्पॉर्टेंट रूट्स which starts from amritsar so let's do map work now so let's understand about golden quadrilateral and other routes from amritsar to the major cities through practical way that is through map so you should have your map that is india political map your pencil your scale and your sketch colors let's start map work now so students this is a map of golden quadrilateral and it is connecting four major cities of india it is very easy to locate points on the map because these are capitals of various states as kolkata is the capital of west bengal chennai is the capital of tamil nadu and mumbai is the capital of maharashtra and delhi it's very easy to locate as the point is given there first of all it is called quadrilateral because it is in a shape of quadrilateral as you can see right so you have to mark these points like this 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 and this then you have to attach these points with the scale till here it will be attached with the scale and this line you have to draw free hand fine this will be in a shape of quadrilateral and after locating the points you have to draw a line there and write kolkata draw a line and write chennai mumbai and delhi and keep one thing in the mind all the writing should be on the map with capital letters no running letters are required here we have to write with capital letters right so this is a map of golden quadrilateral and you have to draw this map with your hands not taking by not taking help of your parents and draw the map of golden quadrilateral so students this is the second map which we have to do in today's topic i have marked the important capitals and cities of different states so if we have to go to kolkata from amritsar we have to mark the point amritsar delhi then lucknow capital of up patna capital of bihar and kolkata capital of west bengal you have to mark these 1 2 3 4 5 points for going to kolkata so we'll draw a line from amritsar to delhi then from delhi to lucknow from lucknow to patna and from patna to kolkata so students after drawing a line you have to mark a line here like this and write amritsar i'm showing it here mark a line like this and write delhi in capital letters same here draw a line line should be straight and it should be in capital letters so students i have marked each and every point like amritsar delhi lucknow patna and kolkata right and mark this whole route as number 1 and let me tell you students that this is a gt road the road which was built by sher shah suri fine we discussed about this road in the above topic right so you have to write it like this also amritsar to kolkata and where you have to go from amritsar then delhi then lucknow then patna and then finally kolkata So let's go to Mumbai now. 
See the route from Amritsar to Delhi will be same for each route. Whether you have to go in uh, east, west or the south. If we have to go to Mumbai, the route will be from Amritsar to Delhi, same. Then we will move to Jaipur, the capital of Rajasthan. Then Gandhinagar, the capital of Gujarat. And then Mumbai capital of Maharashtra fine so again draw a line here and write Jaipur and Gandhinagar here so mark Gandhinagar Mumbai and mark this route as second number so if we have to go from Amritsar to Mumbai, we'll follow this route from Amritsar to Delhi, Delhi to Jaipur, Jaipur to Gandhinagar and Gandhinagar to Mumbai. And we know that Mumbai is the capital of Maharashtra, Gandhinagar is the capital of Gujarat, Jaipur is the capital of Rajasthan. Fine. And here you have to write it like this that Amritsar to Mumbai, second point, Amritsar then Delhi, then Jaipur, then Gandhinagar, and then Mumbai. And if we have to go to Chennai, the route till Delhi will be same. Then from Delhi, we'll move to Bhopal, which is the capital of Madhya Pradesh. And then Nagpur, an important city of Maharashtra. Then Hyderabad, capital of Andhra Pradesh. Then Bengaluru, capital of Karnataka, and then Chennai, capital of Tamil Nadu. So let's mark it here, draw a line, and write it in capital letters. Draw a line, and write Nagpur. And same like that, we have to draw a line and write the name of that particular city. So I have marked the points Nagpur, Hyderabad, Bengaluru and Chennai. From Amritsar to Chennai, we have to follow this route. And we have to write it like this, number third. Amritsar to Chennai. First we'll go to Amritsar, then Delhi, then Bhopal, then Nagpur, then Hyderabad, then Bengaluru and then finally Chennai. So students, this is a map which is very important. Fine. And don't forget that this is GT road. And for making it more beautiful, you can draw these lines with sketch pens, these rules. Right? So I hope the map is clear to you as it is clearly visible. And students, you also have to make the ma map like this only and draw it with pencil. You have to draw the lines with pencil and draw the line, then write it in capital letters. Fine. Right? So I hope it is clear to you. So students, we are done with map work also. And I hope you have understood it very well. And now you also have to practice at your home. Right? And your homework for today is same like yesterday. That you have to read the roadways topic again. And do remember to learn and revise terms.